Good evening, sir. I'm a student. Uh, I'm an engineering student. I'm so happy I got an opportunity to ask you a question. Uh, I'm a dosa lover, and I am so fascinated by your dosa nomics, sir. Uh, the you taught us to protect ourselves, and you taught us that lower interest rate with lower inflation rate is better than higher interest rate with higher inflation rate. Uh, sir, but uh, in real life. Uh, I have a query. Uh, when it comes to dosa prices, when the inflation rates go up, the dosa prices goes up. When, but when the inflation rates are lower, the dosa prices are not lowered. I mean, what is happening to our beloved dosa, sir? Uh, you know, uh, you have hit on another issue in economics. Uh, which is called the Balasa Samuelson effect. Okay? You remember the great economist uh, Paul Samuelson? Uh, he wrote a paper with Balasa. And the idea is the following. Bear with me for one minute. I'll give you this lecture on why dosas are increasing in price. Uh, the technology for making dosas hasn't actually changed. Still today, that, that person puts the uh, mouth on the tawa spreads it around and then takes it out, right? There has been no technological improvement there. However, the wages you're paying that gentleman, especially in a high wage uh, sort of uh, state like Kerala, are going up all the time. Because that uh, worker can be used in much more productive areas, areas where productivity has gone up, such as factory work, such as banking, where today that same bank clerk can service many more people because of technology. So what happens is that in an economy which is uh, growing and where there's sectors which are improving technologically, while other sectors are not improving uh, their technology, the prices for the goods manufactured by the sectors that are not improving their technology will go up faster. That's Balasa Samuelson. You're seeing it in the price of those.